this is Bill Cunningham from the streets of New York City. The holidays are approaching rapidly and a more frantic pace, clearly visible. Last Saturday, the Santa Com group of young adults who get dressed up in some form of Santa uniform, costume, whatever it is, they just roam around the streets dispensing joy making sure they stop into all the taverns. But stylish New Yorkers, not wanting to be caught up in the madness of color and all that's going on, have retreated to their safe heaven of all black. You see here four examples, the long black coat, the very shaped and tailored uh, short black coat, And the most popular look of the season, layers. Everything you can think of, even layers of scarves. But this young man passed by in a black cape, it looked like, and it had had to be at least 30 fur tails dangling all over it. It was simply marvelous. I mean, (laughs) and then a dog wearing a midnight blue turtleneck knitted sweater and standing on his hind legs. Now, you know, I mean, this is just your ordinary day in New York, nothing special at all. And for other people, it was the big fur hat or the scarf pulled up to the knitted caps. They were everywhere, and some of them even in bright fluorescent colors because the weather had become extremely cold, at least on New York standards, and people tend to exaggerate their fashion look. But there's no question the cheer amongst all the hustle and bustle is here. And of the Santa Com, they gathered, as they always do, on the steps of the post office. I thought amusing with those that had done themselves up as gift boxes. There were even Christmas trees with gift boxes on their feet. And I thought it was, you know, sowed some imagination. And uh, it added to the scene. But I love the idea that stylish New Yorkers just couldn't take all of the decoration and colors, and they retreated into black. I mean, it, it's really true to style, their style, that is. But I thought you'd get a fun of seeing the city the week before Christmas. So I hope you enjoy this little peek, and uh, we'll see you next week.